Welcome to Shawnee Union, and this week we're going to talk about how I was able to get a 500cm. I've been looking for this camera for a little bit, and I'm glad I got it. And this is what I usually do. I'll take an older, junkier camera, like the Canon one, fix it up, work on it, and then trade in for a nicer camera, like the Olympus OM one. And this happens over and over again. But I was thinking about upgrading my laptop and putting a new hard drive in it, and I talked to David Hancock. No matter what I did to this laptop, I was going to lose a lot of its value in a couple of years. So I wanted to invest, and I wanted to invest in a camera. When you want to invest in cameras, two names come up, Leica and then Hasselblad. Hasselblads are actually a little bit cheaper right now, so I decided to go with one of those. I looked on Adorama and found a pretty sketchy listing and went for it. So how do I afford a camera like this? Well, I just trade in a lot of my gear I have lying around. And when you do what I do, you end up with a lot of gear. So I took the stuff I didn't want and just sold it all. And this was enough to pay for the Hasselblad. So what happened when it came? It was actually not that sketchy at all. Adorama has a really weird grading system, and this was really undervalued. So it's a perfect camera. It's heavy. It feels really well built, and I can't wait to shoot with it. And I'm actually glad I bought this camera and sold all that gear. But is it really investing? No. Let's say you took $1,095 in 1978, put it into the stock market, never added another dollar. How much do you think you would have in 2013? I'll actually give you a second to think about it. You'd actually have a almost $60,000. Now with $60,000, you could buy more Hasselblads than you can ever use in your lifetime. So it really isn't investing, but at least this camera isn't losing any money over time. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Let me know what you guys think about investing in cameras below in the comments, and I will be back next week to talk about some more cameras. Thank you guys. Bye.